first of all, I would like to thank you for giving us this opportunity. I would like to salute all participants on behalf of my city and on behalf of my people. Gaziantep has a population of 2 million people and we are hosting 500,000 refugees. And we live that for long years. As Emilia has mentioned, it is a special city. And we are ready to share our national and local experience with all of you. First of all, strong leadership is very important. And all world is now aware of that. Together with a strong leadership, it is important to have a strong health infrastructure. And this was the biggest help during Turkey's experience. Almost 18 years ago, Turkey has started a transformation project in health sector. We have invested a lot in health sector and we have created universal uh, social security to everyone and health service to everyone. Now this is our biggest power. We have seen the experience of United States and how much they suffered. And as Turkey, we didn't suffer any of that. And I think that's very important to share, to have universal healthcare coverage and social security. Because that shows that our priority was on human-centered and it was an environmental sensitivity was there. It is not enough just to be economically growing. A humanitarian perspective is very important and those countries who have it uh, managed better. Under this coordination, we had a very good co cooperation between the central government and the local governments. And we had very good cooperation within our municipality. We had a women mentality, feminist approach. When they, we compare this everything, we are now, as Gaziantep City is in a low risk city in Turkey. And we are pleased to be in that condition that we don't have high risk. Our first priority was hygiene, sanitation. Every part of our city, public space or private space that have been cleaned and sanitized by our uh, teams. Since we are an industrial city, we are quite fortunate in terms of having enough fabric. We have produced more than enough masks for our people. We are producing a lot of food as well. So without even stopping our production, we, didn't, we couldn't stop our production. So we made enough activities, measures in the working environments, in mass transportation, in social isolation, and also providing protective equipment. In our big workshops, Together with our uh, women, we have produced uh, masks, not only for our city, but for the rest of the country. We have sent those packages to other countries as well, protective equipment, masks, to all these countries. What's up, Kisinda? Just a second. The, the connection just lost with mayor. Connection is just lost with Madam Mayor. Just one okay. second. Yes, uh, you think you can solve it in the next we, minute? We will, we will if you just give us one second. I'm I'm sorry, but we we will need to go to uh, to the next. Continue speaker. working in that manner, and uh, it is very important to think about the future. Uh, food security and we will uh, we should be able to come up with stronger cities stronger communities and we should 
uh, thank all women working on healthcare sector. And we should also think the position of women working on unregistered sectors. We should create safety for them in their future work. We need a new world order. We need a new social justice and world justice. And, and we need to say new things rather than repeating ourselves. And as Turkey, we are ready to share our experience for our uh, friendly countries. And in the forthcoming period, we had gone through financial crisis before. And the crisis that we have gone through uh, gave us many lessons. We now know which areas we should be stronger. And uh, we set an example to the rest of the world. And, and I I'm quite pleased to have this opportunity to share some of our experience with you. Thank you and uh, regard, uh, salutations from Turkey, from Ghana. Thank you very much, Mayor, for, for sharing this, this important experience and, and, and sorry for, for the technical problems that we have had, but, uh, you know, international work is like that. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, we know that the work that you uh, have done uh, with migrant populations also during the COVID crisis is very significant and that uh, the level of, uh, of disease in the uh, in the migrant community is exactly the same as in the rest of Turkey. So very impressive. We heard about it from one of your colleagues a few days ago. Thank you very much. So now let me go to the, um, we still have something like, like, uh, like uh, three um, speakers uh, left and then we are going to go to the wrap up. Um, allow me now to, uh, to, give, uh, to give the floor uh, to um, the representative of Refela uh, in Ghana, please. Are you there? 